just wanted to say good evening. Good evening to you. Thanks for coming by the, the show. Have a nice uh, glass of iced tea here to uh, keep keep my whistle wet. Uh, thanks everyone for for coming by. Got a whole bunch of shrimps this evening. I went to uh, Target. Yo, Spades, what is up, dude? I went to uh, Target and found uh, these Evolution boosters, which these actually aren't supposed to come out in the U.S. until like the end of March, but. Um, they're at Targets for whatever, for whatever reason. What's ups? Uh, they're at Target for whatever reason, so got a couple of these to strip them. And we also got some Shining Fates, and I got some Korean Shiny V-Star. Now, we opened some Shiny V-Star the other night, but these Shiny V-Star are actually shiny. I don't know if you see this, but it's, uh, it's the box. The box itself is shiny, which is a huge... A huge plus big win I think um, but yeah so uh, let's uh, let's get into some of these shrimps oh hey Adam welcome to the shrimp I'm shiny it is very shiny it's called shiny v star V star star V so um, I guess you know what why don't we uh, we'll start with some pocket monsters why not why not start with start out with some pocket monsters this evening there's a lot of pocket monster stuff to open I got this, uh, uh, yo, Dan, what is up? Hello, Kyle, how are you? I got some pocket, this Pocket Monster Trainer's Toolkit box here. So uh, let's get this camera around. It's gonna take me a second to just make sure I got my whole shrimp set up correctly. I've been doing, trying to do it a little differently, taking some constructive criticism that I've heard from friends and trying to, uh, augment my shrimp scenario so it uh, looks a little better here but yeah we got this uh we got this box it's a little awkward i kind of have to reach around this scenario here but my of course my handy dragon's knife will be very useful for opening up this box i don't think there's much in this box I am teaching a friend how to play Pokemon, and I'm learning myself next week, so... Hey, thanks for smashing that like button, guys. 413 Performance, welcome to the show. We are shrippin'... We are doing some shrippums. Live shrippums. Poke shrippums. Oh, hey, dude. Hey. What's going on? I, uh... I'm, I'm gonna be streaming for, like, two hours. What are you thinking? Yeah. Oh, uh, I just got one of those. Nice. What's, uh... I, I can't really hang right now. Uh, did, Wait, did you text me to come over at six? No, I, I meant like I'm streaming at six. <laughs> I'm the fucking biggest idiot. I'm so sorry. It's cool, dude. I just, I'm fully involved in this. And All right, it takes... I'll head, okay, because I'm gonna dinner again. <laughs> sorry, I'm man. I'm an idiot. Wait, are you You're sorry? not an idiot. You're not an idiot at all. But uh, thanks for Oh, I thought you said slide bye bye. <laughs> Let's, uh, I'm gonna hang with Steve on Monday if you wanna come by. Uh, yeah, play yeah. some games. I'm so sorry. Don't be sorry, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> it's totally fine, man. I was like... <laughs> I, I mean slide by, like, the internet. I sh I could've explained that a little better. <laughs> I feel so dumb right now. Don't, don't feel dumb. It's cool. It'll be a funny, you know, people will get to make... I'm all about jokes anyway, so it's just a good internet joke. I feel anyway. so dumb. I'm, like, sitting there knocking on the door. She's like, the she's like, what are you doing here? I'm like, I don't know. He told me to come by a sick <laughs> <laughs> my bad dude all right i'll, I'll, see, you I'll see you later uh that was my great friend brian he came by i t i messaged him to slide by meaning slide by the live stream but i didn't use uh, enough english to explain what i meant by that so he slid by because he's in the area to hang so whoops Anyway, uh, this is, we're back into the sh Shrippum stream here. So we got this trainer's toolkit. Uh, all right, trainer's toolkit, powerful build to build your deck. This is, uh, this is building. This is a building of, oh yeah, there's some packs in here, I guess. Okay. You never know what's inside the box. Sun and moon. Oh. Sword and Shield and Rebel Clash. There's some dice and counters and... 
Oh, nice sleeves. And, uh, and some energy. Great, well, now we know what's inside that box. Let's get into this shrippums. So thanks for everybody coming by the chat. I wanted to say thanks to you guys. I got my, uh, got my cards here. And let's uh, get some shrippums on. It's online, I gotta figure out this correct the correct method of displaying shrippum here with this. There we go. All right, so these packs I know are, uh, they have this card here at the back and then it's one, two, three, four. No, no worries, dude. There's no, no being late here. We're hanging out. We're hanging out shrippum live, my dude. Don't even sweat it. This energy is the color of water. And that's what's here. I'm trying to do a little different setup, guys. So if anything, you know, if you have any tips, tricks, recommendations, uh, trainer Olivia, if you have any tips, tricks, recommendations of what I could do differently or how I could change things, well, a double trainer, Fra Brawler, more lull, Sandy Gast, Vanipede, I just want to say welcome everybody this evening to this horsey little little horsey one so welcome you the tormenting spray this will torment your prey oh yo we got a full art bodybuilding dumbbells heck yeah if you're looking to get fit if you are looking to put on some muscle mass if you're looking to put on any number of muscle mass this bodybuilding dumbbells is going to be they are going to be the, those will be the best, the best part. Those will be the most effective. Those will be the most effective dumbbells. <sighs> Got to get our sleeves here. This is definitely sleeving material. You know, I love these, I love these items. I love these full art items. I think they're really great. I think full art items are awesome. We should definitely get Purunga back here. Bless the pulls. All right, bodybuilding dumbbells. Look at that! Sh look at that shiny. Those are some shiny dumbbells. These dumbbells are have been. These dumbbells have been glistened. We'll get that into the sleeve, and that will go in our sleeved card pile. Wow! First pack. First pack. What a flex. So I'm gonna need to figure out how to strip them these on this in this angle. Sorry guys. Uh, please excuse my, please excuse my figuring out here. All right. We've got one, two, three, four. Flip them, shrimp them. And we'll put those down. Well, that was great. That was bodybuilding dumbbells are fantastic. Psychic energy there. Uh, Doug Trio. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for coming by. Uh, thanks for coming by the show. Appreciate you guys sliding by, saying hi, hanging out. We'll be, we got a, we got a whole bunch of stuff to strip them tonight. Actually, we have a whole stack of shrimpums. We got a bunch of. Uh, we got a bunch of Pokemon cards and a bunch of uh, Dragon Ball cards as well. Ah, shrimp them. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four. Four shrimp them stacked. If there's any uh, Pokemon you guys would like to see shripped tonight, we are shripping some shiny, shiny Star V, which is pretty exciting. It's a really great looking set. I really like the way that the set looks. I think the cards look really nice. Wow, that's very uh, clay looking. Phantump? Oh, Dreepy, I love Dreepy. I was gonna try immediately abuse her. I can't ban another mod. Yeah, I don't know how it all works, but that sounds like about that. Probo pass. Okay, we got one more pack from this trainer box. These are just like kind of some random packs, I think, that they just stick in here. One, 
two, three, four. Lightning energy. Very nice, very nice. What do we got here? Good evening, everyone. Just, we just want to thank you guys again. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for smashing that like button. Hopefully we can channel our Charizard energy and pull a Korean Charizard. That would be, that would be pretty cool to pull a Korean Charizard. I gotta say, talk about hype, Cardos, Nose Pass, Wingle, Phantom, Bronzor. These are in English, so I can read the names when I don't know the Pokemon. Ooh, Growlithe. I love Growlithe. It's cute. And a Barrett Scooda. Scoodap. Scoodiddly doodab. Dapped. Nugget. What's up, Plant Slayer? I don't know if you guys like iced tea, but I love iced tea. I'm a fanatic for this iced tea stuff. Okay, uh, what do you guys want to see next? Some Pokemon? Should we just sprinkle some Dragon Ball in here? Maybe we'll do all the Dragon Ball stuff at the end. We'll get through the Pokemon, shrip them, and then we'll get into Dragon Ball. So next I've got this um, Vivid Voltage 3-pack. I know these packs are pretty sought after. So let's see how... If I, maybe I can open it like this. Maybe I can shrip them this way so you guys can get a clear view of the exciting process of shrip them live. Shrip them live. Welcome to the Shrip Stadium. There's one. There's three Vivid Voltage packs in here. Found these at Barnes & Noble, actually. I don't know if you guys ever go to Barnes & Noble, but sometimes they have Pokemon cards there, which is exciting. Yeah, Thickachu. I know I've heard there's a there's a Thickachu. I think it's this one, this thick Thickachu right there. Um... You know, if you guys want to put out your, uh, maybe I'll shrip them on this side. You guys can see the shrip them over here, and then I'll put the cards into the frame. Maybe that's a better, a little less awkward situation. That way we'll keep this here. Yeah, Barnes & Noble's definitely got the hidden gems. Like, absolutely. Is this all right if I just, if I just shrip these over here with you guys? That way I'm not doing a weird, like... Oh, yo, Tyler Ellis, what is good, my friend? Welcome to the Shrip'em Show. Is that okay if I do this Shrip'em this way with you guys? And then we can go here, yeah, yeah, like this. One, two, three, four. Any of you guys can guess the energy? I cannot guess the energy because it is patented. It's a patented technique, guess the energy. Giraffage, isn't that a uh, techno artist? Weedle? Bedlam. Oh, we gotta channel the Pikachu energy. Pikachu. Mina. Orani genki o wakate kure. Yeah, maybe we got it. Maybe we got that energy down. It looks like there's something shiny at the back of this pack here. What could it be? Oh, Hero's Metal. Whoa. That is a cool looking card. Wow, the hero's medal has been bestowed upon Vance. Yo, shiny, shiny. Big, full, art, shiny. Let's get that in a sleeve. So, so far we got bodybuilding dumbbells and the electric, the hero's medal. I don't know if, if that isn't hype. I don't know exactly what it is. Yeah, double gold cards. What are the odds? What are the odds to strip them like that? <sighs> All right, one, two, three, four. Feel free to guess the energy, guys. I will not be guessing the energy. I'm not allowed to guess the energy, so I so I won't. Let's see if I turn this a little like that. How's that? Vivid voltage. Yeah, gotta get that chunk of chew. Thickachu, I do not have one of the Thickachus, so I would be I would be hyped to get one. And it's also why a handful uh, of Geico agents used to grow savings beards. Need to make this Geico commercial through. turn down on my uh, royalty-free lo-fi beats going on over here. All right, there we go. Chootle. Riolu, I love Riolu. Weedle, and oh, Electrode. Foil Electrode. 
Looks like he's about to have a real bad time. He might even like blow up or something. Classic. I don't know if you guys know, but in Super Smash Brothers, you can uh, you can grab electrodes. You can pick them up and throw them right before they explode. If you run up to an electrode right as it's about to blow up, you can just... Uh... All right, here's that Pikachu. We got to get it. This is the Vivid Voltage. This is that thick Pikachu. It's in here. It's in this Celebi pack. We all know it's in here. All right. One, two, three, four. Mina, Orani, Genkyo, Wakate, Kure. Wow, I think these have all been metal energy in here. That's pretty metal. That's pretty metal if you ask me about it. Alistair, Metang, Execute, Eevee, Cutie Eevee, Woo Woo Bat, Arokuda. That is a C dot. It's a lot easier when I can read the names. This is some kind of a toucan and a Metaguos. Metaguos. Very nice. All right, so. I mean, you can't be mad about that hero's metal. It's pretty hype. All right. Uh, let's get into next. I have this. Um, I think this is a Japanese box of Unified Minds. I'm pretty sure that's the set that this is. Uh, oh. All right. Sorry about that. Um, let's uh, let's get this open here. Slice them, shrimp them. Got that sliced. All nice. All right. I'm not sure what's cool in this set, but maybe we'll find something cool. Zach Herbert, here for the Shrippums. Welcome for the Shrippums, dude. Thanks for coming by. Thank you for coming along. We got a whole bunch of Shrippums, as you can see. We have all these pocket monsters to shrimp them the box right here. So I'll just put those over here and we will shrimp them on this side and reveal them on that side as I don't know if uh, the Japanese packs do the same thing. Oh, these don't feel like they have as many cards in them. I wonder how many cards each of these have. One, two, three, four. There's just five cards in each of these packs. That's weird. Definitely not heavy packs. I would, I would call these thin packs, if anything. But, I mean, we are going to crack this whole booster, so there should be some good stuff in here. Oh, thanks, dude. I, uh, you know, I work hard on it. I take good care of it. I wash my hair. Wow, this Lapras is really cool. I love this Lapras card. I, uh, yeah, I, I wash my hair every day. I wash my hair every day. I try to take really good care of it. Oh, yeah, I'm stripping them on this side. I'm stripping them on this side, and then I'm going to reveal them on the other side, just because the way my setup is right now makes it a little hard to... Some Japanese sets only have five cards per pack. Yeah, well, that makes sense, and I, I guess that would that would mean that this is one of the sets, because there's definitely only five cards in this pack. That set is called Miracle Twins, which came over as Unified Minds. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought it was... Uh, Unified Minds. I've seen Unified Minds, but I didn't know it was called Miracle Twins in Japanese. That's cool information. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, 413 Performance. Same with Dollar Store English Packs. Interesting. Dollar Store English Packs only have five parts. Is that how that works? All right, let's check it out here. Ooh, that's a cool looking turtle. Ooh, Celebi. Hollow foil Celebi. That's a nice looking card. All Japanese packs are five cards with the exception of All Star Lake Shiny V. Oh, interesting. Yeah, Shiny V definitely is pretty fire. We're going to be opening some Korean Shiny V Star. Uh, shout out to my boy in Korea, Dong Woo. Ha. Huh. Ooh, anything fun and shiny in here? No, just that's a cool looking Pokemon. I feel like I've seen that one in the game. I feel like I've seen it in the game somewhere. Alright, we got a lot of 
fun drag. I'm really excited to open the Dragon Ball packs because the Dragon Ball packs actually officially aren't released yet, and we just were lucky to find some. Oh, this looks like a GX. Oh, that Dratini is sweet. Love that Dratini. Oh, yo. I think this is a secret, possibly. This is a good looking card. Wow, yo. Psyduck and Slowpoke. Having a good time. Just hanging out. Having a good time as friends, as pals. Doing the old piggyback team tag, tag team. Very nice. Beautiful card. Gorgeous looking card. That definitely gets sleeved. Put it in your sleeveies. I don't know what the drop rates are on this box. That may have been like the only really shiny thing that we get out of these packs. I don't really know how it works. Brian Gregson, welcome, dude. <laughs> Thanks for coming to the stream. <laughs> Definitely psyched to open some Pokemon packs. I'm really excited to see what's inside of them. They go great together. Yeah, they really do. They look real cute, don't they? They're just hanging out there. It's like we got each other's back. Nobody's going to mess us up with that. Whoa. Yo, that's a cool looking card. Does anybody know the name of this Pokemon? That was a rad looking Pokemon. Some sort of sea creature, creature of the sea. Making pretty good progress through the strip them. And then after this, we have a, uh, I think we'll get into the uh, Korean shiny V-Star. Dong, if you've made it to the chat, you know, Say hi so I know you're here, and then I'll get into those Korean cards. All right, that's cute. Oh, that dragon here looks so cool. Yo, what is that? That's cool. Anagi. Shrippa. Is it cool to like play with, like, can you play with American cards and just use like Japanese energy? Is that a reasonable thing to do or is that like, no way, dude. Too, too crazy. Don't go there. Do you know? Does anybody have an answer for me about that? I would love to know. And another bunch of cute Pokemon. Yeah, we got 11 people in the chat here. Welcome, everybody. Welcome to the stream. I want to say thanks to everybody for coming by. Do you ever strip them other... I have not done Card Fight or Yu-Gi-Oh! So I don't really like doing content about things that I don't know anything about. I don't know as much as I used to know about Pokemon, but I'm interested in learning more. And that's actually why I've been doing uh, shrimp on poke with Pokemon on live streams only and not really doing as many videos. I tried to do a video and I tried to do a Digimon video, but I, f I feel like I want to do really focus on the Dragon Ball openings for the videos because I know more about it. So I feel like I can actually talk about it. The Pokemon's fun on live stream because I feel like I get to interact with you guys and you guys can kind of tell me if I don't know what a Pokemon is, I can ask or ask questions and there's a lot of knowledgeable people in here. So it's kind of a win for me because I get to come in here, open packs and learn about Pokemon from all the knowledgeable folks in the chat. So uh, I have a lot of fun with that. And I thank you guys for the information. Um, but yeah, card fight and Yu-Gi-Oh! I probably won't do. I really know nothing about the characters. I know nothing about the game. Um, ah, thank you for the timeout, dude. Got some mods in here now, so the uh, spams won't be... Oh, yo, another... We got the... the uh, this is the normal art, I guess, of the same card? That is awesome. I want to say since the backs are different, they wouldn't be allowed in tournament play, but I don't think it would be a problem using Japanese. Yeah, well, I, I'll probably only be playing with friends. That's a great looking card. Look, we got the we got the friends again. Just two friends hanging out. Let's look at those together. Just some friends hanging out, having a great time here for the shrimpum. Thanks for coming by. Hey Brian, if you're if you're here, sorry about that miscommunication, dude. I I feel bad about that. I uh, I clearly didn't use the right words to describe the accuracy of what I was saying. My bad. That's on me completely. But uh, yeah, let's get some hangs in soon, my dude. 
train those Dragon Ball. Oh, yo, yes, Dragonite, yes, yes. I love Dragonite. Dragonite is my favorite Pokemon, and this is so cute. This is such a cute Dragonite. Look, just relaxed, catching a swell. That is gonna go on the Dragonite page. I have a page of Dragonite cards that I keep there. Uh, I missed that last message. Sorry if I miss your messages, guys. Feel free to, you know, send a message twice. It comes up on my iPhone and sometimes I'm looking the other way and I seem to miss it, but I'm doing my best to engage with you guys as much as possible. Um, feel free to, you know, send a message two or three times if I miss it. I will do my best to catch it. That's extremely cute. Rangu Tangu. Executor. Executor is my brother's favorite Pokemon because he told me that he thinks it's the least liked Pokemon, which I think is really nice of him to, you know, put it out there for a Pokemon that doesn't get the right rep out in the game. Oh, I love this Lapras. It's such a good looking Lapras. Crafty, I think, is that Pokemon's name? Scrafty? Oh, JC the Forest. Yeah, Dragonite is my favorite. I, I remember when I played, um, Pokemon uh, Blue, like the first one that came out, when I got Dragonite, I was just like, this is like too cool. And I trained it from a Dratini, so it got to evolve and all that. And I remember uh, I traded it to one of my friends and then they didn't give it back to me. There's that Dragonite here. Here's this boy. Love the grass psychic type. Yeah, you know, Brian Gregson, you, uh, your, your first starter was Venusaur. I do remember me, you, and Steve hanging out in the, in the pregame lobby, so to speak, before cards. We are the three starter boys. I did pick Squirtle as my first, and, you know, if I were to name my son Squirr, his name would be Squirtle. So that's cool. That's pretty fun and cool. So does anybody else know anything else that's hype in this set that we might pull? I don't know what kind of energy to put out there to try and manifest the pull from here. But, uh, ooh, Tapu Coco, I think that is. Oh, we also have a Tapu Coco box. Um, wouldn't it be crazy if we pulled a Korean Charizard? How wild would it be if we pulled a Korean Charizard tonight? I don't know, guys. You tell me. You let me know. Somebody somebody really manifested the Charizard energy in the chat last time, and I, I definitely attribute. Dragonite has one of the ugliest shiny forms. Yeah, I don't think Dragonite's shiny is all that cool. Seems like the color isn't really anything more special. The Mew and Mewtwo team cards are pretty hype. Cool. Well, maybe we'll pull one of those. I think actually we already pulled our secret though, so I don't know if we'll pull another like big card like that. I think so far we only pulled one of the... We pulled the one GX and the one secret, and it was Psyduck and Slowpoke. But they're cuties. I'm cool with that. They're very cute cards. Dongwoo, you will send me a Korean Charizard, bro, dude. Dude, you're going to make me fly off my seat right now if you, you use those kind of words. That's crazy talk, man. I don't want to take your Charizards from you. You have many. All right, look. Then I'm not going to I'm not going to I'm not going to argue that, man. I'll come over there. I'll trade you some Dragon Ball cards. You know, we'll make it a fair trade. I don't want to just take cards. I appreciate the uh, the uh, offer, but I do like to trade cards. So, oh, yo, Tyranitar and Say Sableye, I think, is that Pokemon's name? This card is sick, yo. What a cool looking card. Very, very rad. Look how it's like they, they made like the light diffraction and the gem and stuff. That's really rad. That is a rad pull. Psyched about that. And Jinx. All right, a couple more packs here. So I guess we pulled two of the Tag Team GX so far, and one of the, I think that was the Secret Rare. There's probably just one like that in the, the Mew and Mewtwo is the best one in the set, word. Yeah, I kind of figured that since they're like on the box and stuff, I imagine they're probably the go-tos. There's three more packs here from this box, and then it is Korean uh, Shiny V-Star time. Very exciting stuff. 
very, very, very exciting. I I think the, the Korean boxes already, I think, are cooler because the boxes themselves are shiny. So I think that's rad. Yo, 413 performance. Thank you for being on top of it, my guy. My guy. A couple more cards here. Amoongus. The Fungus Amoongus. Oh, a trainer. Cute. Trip them. Trip them live. Hey, I want to say thanks to everybody that's here. I want to say thanks to everybody that's hitting that like button. It really helps me out when you guys like the videos. It makes them more seen by other people. More people can join the Joe crew. You know, the more the merrier is what they say. And here's the last. Oh, we didn't do a bless in the pack. I guess we got a bless in the pack. Bless them. Bless them, my little Mew, my little Mew too. Maybe inside here it shall be blessed. If we can find it the rest of the way and what is inside this blessed pack it is oh yo we blessed the latius is that latius or latios i think that's latias i think latios is red but the blessum clearly worked we just blessed the pack and then here we go we get this shiny full art gx and that's um that's bless him. That's bless him. Be real. Wow, what a, what a fun box. That was a really fun box to open. Okay, what's next here? We're going to do Korean Shiny V-Star. Latios is blue. Okay, that's Latios. So Latias is the red one. Thank you. Thank you for the correction. Dragon's Knife. Shrip him. Shiny V-Star. Korean shiny V-Star boxes. Oh yeah. So hype. So hype. Look, look, they're shiny. They're sh the boxes are shiny. It's like, that's a, you know, I love Japan, but I gotta say, Japan didn't make their boxes shiny. They may be made in Japan. Oh, and they open from the top? Or they have a thing that breaks there that you can open them that way. But this is a nice box. I wanna keep this box intact. All right, so let's bless in the pack here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six packet. You bless it. This is the packet that is the bless in the pack. Thank you, pack, for your blessings. Shall be lessons to all of us to know that the blessing comes from head to toe. Yeah, shiny V Star is ten packs per box. Definitely, I feel confident that I've opened enough of these at this point that I know how many are in these boxes. Uh, I should probably be wearing a glove. All right, let's get the glove on. It's gloving time. Time to get glovered. All right. Yo, the Korean text looks so rad. I love that. How fun is that to look at? I think there's a VMAX in this pack also. What do we got here? Sigliff, that's Joyce's favorite Pokemon. Joyce's favorite. Ooh, that's cute. That's cute. And, oh, yo, VMAX Dragapult Korean to kick it off. Heck yeah, Dragapult is my favorite new Pokemon out of all the new Pokemon. And we got, and we got the ball guy. Yo, look at this ball guy. He's got all these shiny orbs. Ball guy, what a king. What an absolute winner. All right, what's next here? For our next Korean shiny V, Shrip 'em. Tonight on the Joku, Saturday night, Shrip 'em live. We got 15 people in the chat, five likes. Y'all are the best. Let's get that Charizard energy out there. Mina, orani, genki o wakate kure. What is at the back of the pack? There's only a few ways to find out, but it looks shiny. I think it looks like it might be a V Max, actually. A squirrel, a rock man, rocking his way to the party. The Galarian, yeah, oh, doggo. Hello, doggo, fancy seeing you here. And a Grookey, whoa, yo, look at those, look how cool that foiling is. It's so rad. What a radical, radical foiling. Big Charizard pull, that's what I'm saying, Adam. That is what I'm saying. Let's get that Charizard Mina Orina Genkyo Wakate Kure energy. 
If you guys have any friends that you think would enjoy, you know, coming and hanging out in the chat, feel free to shoot out a little message here or there. There's a, you can take a link to the link to the stream and just send it out to a pal and say, hey guys, you know, Joku is cracking packs. We're Shrip em Live. It's Saturday night for a Shrip em Live. You might even enjoy the party. Oh, Susine, Susine, is that how you say that? Eldgoss, and this Scentiscorch, super shineful. How fun is that? Another Shrip'em, another Saturday Night Shrip'em. All right, who's saying Charizard in these fire poles? I think, I think it's about time that we find a Charizard in here. I want to, I want to apologize if I'm missing anybody's uh, messages also. The messages come down on the bottom of my screen. I'm trying to pay attention, but, you know, feel free to just shoot it again if I do miss it. This is nice. This Korean, oh, is that a Alolan Darakuma or Galarian? Fire spin attack. That's what I'm saying, dude. Get that fire spin attack energy out there and Charizard will find us. Whoa, that Decidueye is sick. I think that's Decidueye. I might be wrong. Doggo. And a, yo, V Max Toxtricity. Sick. Okay, so, so far, the two, <laughs> both third V Max Charizard, I'm going to cry. Yeah, I know. Me too, dude. I probably will. So far, we just pulled our two favorite V Maxes of this set. We got Toxtricity and Dragapult in Korean now. So, that's hype to add to the collection. I got a book of juicies that I keep, just juicy Pokemon cards that I like to look at. I can show it to you guys later if you want to have a look. I can definitely pull that out. All right, I think we might have something exciting in this pack. I feel like I caught a little glimpse. I feel like I felt something sh something very shiny hit my eyes. Come on, Charizard. Where you at, boy? Where you at? Looking big and strong. Breathing fire all night long. And... Oh, my God! <laughs> of course... Of course, there was no other option. It had to be the shiny VMAX Crobat. That is, the last shiny VMAX that we pulled on stream was a shiny VMAX Crobat. So of course, it had to be. I forgot to put on my repel, and that is, that's the situation. But, um, you know, since we're here, let's get a, let's get a closer look here at this uh, shiny Korean Crobat. Oh, wow. That's pretty good. That is some pretty shiny strip of material right there. No way. Crobat number seven. Oh my god. The PSA hikes, dude. Don't even get me started on the PSA hikes. Holy hexagon. They went up literally the day I, w I went to send my package out. I got royally scrooged. That is a great looking card. I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad. Crobat is your favorite, don't lie. Yeah, I know. I kind of I kind of do like Crobat. I mean, I, I like, you know, I like trolling and I like getting trolled. So I just, you know, if I'm going to be here getting trolled by Crobats, I got no problem with that. I brought it on to myself. And I'm pretty sure, you know, the box on the other side of the Crobat was a, was a Charizard, I think. So maybe, you know, we have one other box. Maybe that box is going to be the Charizard. So, so we will find out soon. Sooner rather than not soon. All right. Wait for this ad to go away. Excuse me, ad, please go away so we can. Um, how's the uh, how's the volume of the music and stuff, guys? Does it sound all right? Is it too overpowering? I can I can turn the I can turn the tunes down if they're too loud. Just let me know. I don't, I didn't do a test here, so I don't really know if it's needs to, ch oh, Amazing Rare Restroom. Oh, that, well, that's at the back. That's different. I think that was usually before those cards. And a Mr. Rhyme, sh looking shiny. Let's put this Resher in the sleeve. Perfect volume. Awesome. Thanks. Oh, good. Yeah, okay. Thank goodness. So we do have some shiny, uh... We do have some uh, Shining Fates to open up. We'll, we'll open that at the end of the Pokemon trip. But I'm excited to get to this Dragon Ball stuff. The Dragon Ball cards are so hype. So I'm definitely going to I'm gonna kind of power through these cards a little bit more so we can get to this Evolution Booster stuff. Oh, and we got a V Dragapult. All right. All right. I'll take it. 
I'm excited. The Dragapult pages. Oh, and we got a shiny Galarian. What is this guy's name again? Somebody let me know, please, down there. Very exciting. Waku Waku. Is that Meowth? Is it an evolution of Meowth? I don't know. I could be making that up. I could be totally wrong. I accept the fact that there are a lot of things in life that I'm totally wrong about. This is cool. This is a cool looking card. Berserker. Is Berserker related to Meowth? Is there anything there or am I just making that up? Am I making up Berserker's relation to Meowth? Could be. Hatterene. And a V Birdo. Ooh, shiny double. That's cool. That's a cool looking shiny. I dig that. I'm gonna have fun pulling that. I think that's shiny double. <laughs> Nightmare! Yo, brain, what is up, dude? Welcome to the stream. For those of you that don't know Brian Grant, you should. I would like to introduce you to my great friend, one of my streaming friends from uh, from back in the days when I used to play Marvel Contest of Champions. Uh, Brian is one of the most wonderful content creators. If you guys are interested in seeing some iPhone gaming take place, definitely head over to his channel and check it out. Really fun stuff. We may be collaborating on some stuff. We were on the phone the other day talking about some... Oh, yo, sick! Is this, this is like the Zigazoon evolution. I don't know what this guy's name is, but he's cool. And I like how on the shiny card, it's black around it. Somebody remind me this guy's name, please. I have all of the OG 150 from back in the day. Shiny Charizard, dude. That's what I'm saying, yo. You gotta, you gotta get those graded, Adam. Yeah, the PSA price spike really... Hemorrhoid hit me. It's a nightmare. Oh, we got, do we have some contest friends coming over here? Guys, I miss you guys. Thanks for coming by. Check out the Bless in the Pack. We're stripping this Bless in the Pack right now. I got a glove on. I got my I got my loops to inspect when we get the shinies. It is a it is a good night for checking it out. Obstagoon. Obstagoon, because he's like a goon that is an obstacle. This should be a VMAX, I think. I think this should be our third VMAX. It's probably not gonna have a shiny anything in it, but it should be a VMAX, I think. And it is not. It's a V. Doggo. What was our third VMAX? I know we got... Uh... Yeah, it's kind of like... If you're going to be, you know, apart from them for like a year, if they're not something you care about and look at with frequency, it probably doesn't matter. But it's an investment, you know. You, I, I just sent the stuff that was like good-looking foils from my uh, my original... Set. Okay, we got another box of shiny V Star. Let's get into here, and then we'll crack through the rest of these Pokemon boxes. I have a Meowth V Max box, which I think it has an X Y Evolutions pack in it, and I'm, from what I understand, X Y Evolutions is a pretty hype, uh, pretty hype set. So, pop them off, pop them off like my nightmares. Hemorrhoid Hitman, <laughs> what is up, dude? All right, let's get in here. These packs are dedicated to Dong Wu. Dong Wu, you are the man. Thanks for coming by the channel. Thanks for all the support, man. A real king. And I know, and I know it. Ryan Maloney, what's up, handsome? Let's find these packs. One, two, three, four, five, six bless in the pack. This is the lesson of the blossom. Hello, blossom. Thank you for being such a blessed pack. We appreciate you in our blossom ceremony. We couldn't have the blessing ceremony without you, so thanks for being there for us. Let's get into these shrimp ones, huh? What is going to be in this box? We're going to get one shiny thing in this box. Yeah, the Korean shiny crowbat. What a meme. What an absolute meme I am of myself. So much fun. Such an absolutely good time. Zappo energy. Oh, yeah. Doggo. Gengar. Yes, we got the Korean Gengar. And a V Doggo. Double Doggo. Doggo down. It is Doggo Town. Welcome to it. There's all dogs around. And this trainer's milk dud. Very wonderful. Purunga, get in here. Show us some support, my friend. Bless these packs with us. Let's find that char shiny Charizard. Let's put that Charizard energy out there. We ha really have to. 
fire spin attack. Adam's Adam put some Charizard energy out there, so I, I really appreciate that. And uh, and you know, hopefully we'll find the shiny Charizard here with the with the energy that's been sent out into the universe of the fire spin attack. This is no Dragon Ball. Dang right, it's no Dragon Ball. But we have Dragon Ball, and I will show you. I have Evolution Booster and Vicious Rejuvenation, which we will be getting into. We got some. Yeah, Perunga going, okay. That's what I'm saying, dude. All right, we got a V-Boy. Oh, and another Amazing Rare, Reshiram. So we got both of the Amazing Rares from the Korean cards are the same. Ain't no Ember here. Not yet. Not yet is the attitude. Let's get that Ember pumping. Let's get that Ember flowing. I have an Ember. It do be growing. Charizard Energy. Dude, if you don't pop a Charizard. Dude, I'm not going to let you give me a Charizard. I will trade you for a Charizard. But you're too nice. You're too nice, man. You send me... I'll, well, I'll have to send you something. That's only fair. Ooh. Ooh. And do we have a VMAX here? Oh, yeah. VMAX Centiscorch. Yo. Yo, Zar. That's what I'm saying. Ryan Maloney, put those vibes out there, dude. Somebody's got to put the vibes out there. If we don't, who will, right? If we're not here putting the vibes out there, you think somebody's going to be putting the vibes out there for us? No, we got to do it together. We're in this together. We're a team. We're a team here. We're on the Joe Crew. We are all part of the Joe Crew here. We have to be. Hey, thank you guys for smashing that like button. I really, really appreciate it. Love your attic space. Real cavern. Yeah, it definitely is, man. Sounds fair, bro. Yeah, I'm into trades. Fair trades, dude. I'm here for fair trades, Dong Wu. I'm not about to take advantage of you just because I'm some guy on the internet that makes videos that you enjoy. I appreciate you a lot. Best move for Charizard, Fire Spin, and Blast Burn. I, I'm with it, dude. I'm with the, the Fire Spin and Blast Burn and Charizard Energy. Mina, Orani, Genkyo, Wakate, Kure. Oh, Lapras V, cool. It's exciting to add to the collection. And this very psychedelic looking card. Pull out Alpha Black Lotus next. Hey, you never know, man. You know, sleight of hand. Hey, thanks for smashing that like button, guys. I really appreciate it. Very thoughtful of you guys. You know, it makes makes makes, it, makes me more motivated to keep uh, to keep doing stuff. I've been getting so much positive feedback from everyone in the community, and I'm just really hyped about doing these videos. I hope uh, I hope you guys got to see my uh, movie this morning. I did a uh, story. Yeah, it was a bunch of likes coming in. Thanks, guys. Uh, yeah, I did a, uh, a video on the Awakened Power, telling the story of the Awakened Power, and, you know, a little bit of, oh, we got another Toxtricity, hype, 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 I am with it, I am with the VMAX Toxtricity, all about it, going into the sleeve, and this great looking cutie pie, ah, uh, yeah, so I did a, oh, another like, thanks, yo, thank you guys for smushing that like button, yeah, I did a little story about uh, Son Goku, the Awakened Power, and uh, uh, next weekend will be a deck profile. Uh, next week, uh, uh, Cross Worlds box opening is going to be the featured Wednesday Shrippum, and then uh, next Saturday is going to be a deck profile on Dark Broly, and then the following Saturday is going to be a SCR story on what is my favorite SCR. Uh, oh, yo, shiny V Dragapult. I am down with that. Heck yes, gamers. Yo, the V Korean shiny Dragapult. I will take it. I will take this card. And Dong Wu, I am down to trade with you, my guy. All right, we got a couple Shrippums left here. What are we going to pull? Deck profile, nice. Yeah, it's going to be deck profile on Dark Broly. I've been playing Dark Broly, and I really like it. Um, you know, I still feel like out of the videos I'm doing, I, I, I like the Shrippums. I feel like I'm getting uh, I feel like I'm getting better with the editing and, and getting bringing it together a little better. Um, with, uh, with the SER store, I feel like that one was pretty good. I feel like there's room for improvement, so hopefully I can step it up with the next one and make, a, you know, make enough jokes about potatoes. And, uh, oh, a shiny, shiny moth. What is this Pokemon's name? Please, please tell me. This is beautiful. I love blue and yellow. So this is a really fun card to pull. It's a nice shiny. We should be getting some the shinies. I don't think we pulled any 
shiny so far. That's our first one. So there should be like two more out of these three packs. The stripping musics do have the, the the stripping videos do have that hot music. Shout out to my bro, Josh Atoll, aka Space Jesus. If you haven't checked his music out, you absolutely should. Frost Moth. That sounds right. I believe that. Frost Moth. Shiny Frost Moth. Fire Pull. I'm here for it. What is back here? Ooh, a V Crobat. And a Whoa! Yo! Sick! What is that? What the heck is that card? Let's get a closer look at that one, gang. Whoa, yo, that is a fine looking card there. Holy hex be gone. Uh, it reads moth in Korea. What, does anybody know what this card is? This card is rad. Eternatus V, wow. Wow, that is a, that is, pretty good good looking card wow really nice looking that shine the the way is like different there's like different sizes of uh glitter all over it so how many boxes new dbs that we pull when it's awaken power reprint <laughs> uh i i don't think they'll ever reprint awaken power actually to be quite honest if they do it's gonna probably be in something like um yeah, pulling all the gold cards tonight, dude. I got golden hands over here. If they reprint Awaken Power, I think it's going to be in a collector's edition kind of thing, so you'll be guaranteed to get it, and they'll probably do some different kind of foiling. Um, I think Bandai's really good about, uh, like, not devaluing the old cards that they've made. And, like, they essentially started this game and didn't promote it, so the people that, like, found out about it and were with it and a part of the... Really, that's very hard to pull. Cool. Well, we pulled it. We pulled it, gang, and we got the shiny V Dragapult. I'm hype about that. All right. So we are through that box. Let's set these cardos aside. Make some space here. Hey, I wanted to give a special thanks to everybody that has come through the chat tonight. Thank you guys for coming to the stream. Thanks for hanging out. I enjoy your presence. Uh, the present of your presence is a wonderful present to me. I'm just going to make some space here real quick for the rest of the cards throughout this. Oh, wait, we got the Bless in the Pack. Holy hexagon. Almost forgot the Bless in the Pack. Wouldn't that be crazy? Just have a Bless in the Pack sitting here the whole time? Hemorrhoid Hitman. Yo, that was Jembus. You know what I'm talking about, dude. Slap that Jembus. I haven't forgotten. I may be gone, but I have not forgotten. Bless of the Pack. We got it right here, Dong Woo. We are shripping it. It is time. It's, I feel like there should be a shiny Pokemon in here. Let's see. Something shiny, something shiny, something shiny. Come on. Shiny, 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 shiny. Uh, v. Shiny Grookey. Yo. Okay, now we got the English, we got the Japanese, and we got the Korean shiny Grookey. Heck yes, gamers. You love to see it. You absolutely love to see these shiny pocket monsters. Who doesn't? I know, nobody, because they're great to see. All right, next box. What are we going into next? Next, let's get into... What do you guys think? Should we should we strip the... Let's do this Tapu Coco box. Yeah, I got this Tapu Coco box with this giant Tapu Coco in the back. So let's get this stripped. Would you like to get... Uh, a55. I'm not exactly sure what an A55 is, but I wouldn't say it exactly sounds like something that I would be interested in. Still not sure what you're talking about, but let's uh, get this shrimp going here. All right, we got this box with a top of cocoa. Dan, if you're here, we were together when I, when I got this box. I still haven't opened it. I just been having it sitting around. Whoops. Everything just fell out of there. Uh, no problem. Wow, they really wedge these cards in here so you can't ever get them out. Okay. That is dented. Uh, okay, one pack, two pack, three packs. There's three packs in here. They just fell onto the table, but I am acquiring them with my foot right now. All right, and there's this giant Tapu Coco in there. That's 
That is a big card. That is a big looking card. We'll put that back there. It's a nice little backdrop effect. Well, let's get some shrimps here, shall we? Maybe we'll pull something cool. We got sun and moon. We got sun and moon, guardians rising. You know, you could purchase some cheap units. Jumbo, uh, that, is not, that is not the game I play anymore, my friend. I wish I could advise you. But uh, one, two, three, four, and yeah, that is that is something I cannot give you advice about, unfortunately. But if you want to know about Dragon Ball or Pokemon cards, this is the place to see them and to strip them and to learn about them. We're all learning we're all learning tons here about Pokemon right now. It's uh, really wait, what the heck? I must have spun those cards around or something upside down. I quit MCOC because I decided to become a doctor and I didn't have time in my life to play the amount that is required in order to make progress in that game and keep up with it. It was becoming very damaging to a lot of the personal and friendly relationships in my life. And uh, as much as I love the game, it was something that I couldn't keep up with in my life any longer so i have since one two three four moved on to other games still love gaming still an avid gamer just not in the contest don't play contests it's not doc recommended <laughs> it's a really fun game and you know i i big respect to all the content creators out there for the game I've had a lot of fun with the game, and I'll admit, I definitely missed... Ooh, that's cute. It's a Lolan Vulpix. I definitely missed the game. I had a lot of fun playing it, and, uh, you know, it's just uh, the time commitment for me at this point in life is not something that I can that I can do with how much I know I love playing the game and how, how frequently I would play it if I did. Uh, one, two, three, four... Whoops, did I do that wrong? That doesn't look right. Looks like I did that incorrectly. Um, but yeah, it's a really fun game. It's fun to play, you know, on a team and have a bunch of pals. Oh, yo, another gold carbink. Carbink break. Uh, sorry, I just missed that last message. I saw something about boyfriend, but then I didn't see the rest of the message. Sorry, if you want to send that message again, I'll try to read it there and respond. Uh, okay, time for the next box, I guess. Let's um, let's get into this um, Meowth box. There's a um, that is my personal information, and uh, I could be, I could not be. I do think that the dictionary definition of that word refers to a very happy person, and I would say I am certainly a very, very happy person. Uh, I am engaged to a beautiful acupuncturist. She practices in Princeton, New Jersey. Uh, all right, we got this cool box here. What is going on? We got some, I think this is the hot cash box, because it's got Meowth, and I know Meowth is a hot cash Pokemon. Look at the size of this. Look at the size of this hot cash meowth. Wow. Hot cash. That's one big hot cash meowth. Max G Max Gold Rush. Why don't you just say G Max Hot Cash Ultimate Cash G Pokemon? Your boy you mentioned your boyfriend does your camera work in the room tour. Does he play too? I uh I have a lot of boyfriends actually. Um, so I don't know which boyfriend you're referring to, but I like to think that I have a ton of boyfriends because I do have many friends and they're all very handsome boys. So, uh, yeah, I do, uh, I, uh, I don't have somebody that does the camera work for me. I, I do, uh, all the camera work and editing myself now. But uh, uh, I am taken. I'm not on the market. I can tell you that. I'm not uh, available in that sense. Uh, we got four packs here from this box. And one of them is an XY Evolutions pack. I know there's a lot of really hype stuff in XY Evolutions pack. So this is... Uh, you'll be my boyfriend. <laughs> 
Well, dude, thanks for hanging around. You know, I know it's been a, it's been a change. Been I've been through a lot of different phases on YouTube, and I'm entering this new phase. And hopefully, uh, you know, can be an accessible, fun experience for a lot of different people. My camera. Uh, one, two, three, four. Steve, yeah, Steve. Steve does some great, great cam work. I would definitely refer to Steve as my boyfriend. He is a friend that is a boy. This is what kind of energy is this? Cool. Cricketune, Curlia, Bisharp, Sfeel, Pasmayan, Lillipup, Skrelp, ooh, Reverse Hollow Eevee, and a Fione. He's talking about the tour of you organizing your cards. Oh, oh, my boyfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Steve. Yeah, I, I just refer to uh, like friends of mine that are boys. I call them boyfriends because I think it's funny. Yeah, Steve definitely did the camera work for that. Steve is the king. Steve also is in a um, monogamous heterosexual relationship. Uh, one, two, three, four to the front. And we have our energy here. Ooh, that, that's the same Lapras art. I love this Lapras. How cute is that? Fracture, Pikachu, Lickitung, Purloin, Magmar, Tynamo, a great potion. Gotta have it, gotta love it. Scrafty. All right, we got this Cosmic Eclipse K pack here. And we'll save the XY Evolutions pack for last because I think that's the most hype pack from this box. We have one, two, three, four here. Psychic energy. I don't know. I mean, I, if I was going to pull anything from the XY Evolutions, I like that shiny Vulpix you got a couple packs back. He's a good boy. Yeah, Vulpix is a good boy. Yeah, the Alolan one, or the Galarian one, I think it was. It was, like, white. It looked really good. Mag Cargo. Oh, whoa, look, double Mag Cargo. Okay, so we didn't pull anything like really hype for any of these packs. So there's a chance that the Evolutions pack might be something hot in here. Yeah, I think it's overhyped also. There's not really like that much. I don't know. Oh, let's let's bless this pack. OXY Evolutions pack with your Raichu power be blessed. I've seen so many Raichus be pulled lately. So maybe inside this Raichu pack, there is something excellent. Your packeth be blessed. We bless it unto you. Thank you for taking the lesson, and this rip, this shrippum shall be true. I think that's how the story goes. Let me put these, oops. And let's get this shrippum. XY Evolution shrippum, the moment we've all been waiting for. I'm just gonna put a card back here in case there is something really hype. That way the back of the card won't get out. One, two, three, four. And you guys can see what, oh, I did that wrong. Oh, I guess that's the card we pulled. EX Mewtwo. <laughs> yeah, I feel like, uh, yeah, well, that's that's a cool card. That I guess that's a good pull. We didn't really do that counting right, but that's a, cool looking card i'll definitely put that in the binder of juicies it's not a full art but nice nice hollow foil i think that's it right there's nothing else in this pack a sand true okay reverse hollow foil sand true cool cool whoopsie wrong on the counting there sorry guys miscounted mistook my counting okay so next we have we have we'll save the um we'll save the hidden fates shining fates for last let's get into some dragon ball all right so we have all of these blister packs oh. the blister packs come in these cardboard things we have a bunch of them here i'm just gonna rip i'm gonna strip open the blister packs and get all the packs out and then that way we can do the strip ups a little faster the nostalgia isn't worth a small amount of big pulls that come from evolutions. How overprinted the set is interesting. All right, we're getting these packs out. 
yeah, X, this this is the real hype right now. I'm so hyped for these uh, evolution boosters. I these this set's not actually supposed to come out for a couple weeks, so it's pretty dang exciting to shrip them these packs. Let's just get all the packs out here. This is vicious Reju rejuvenations. Maybe we'll get a yokai from our vicious rejuvenations pack. That could be rad. But I'm doing a little quick strip them here for all these blisters. These are called blister packs. They come in cardboard. Got them all on my lap right now. Strip them. X Evolution Booster. This is this is what we are opening next. It's very very exciting stuff. Uh, Vegeta. There's a there's a secret rare, the heroine's secret rare. So the new archetype in the Battle Evolution Booster is the heroine archetype. Um, it's pretty exciting that there's you know giving females some power and recognition here with their own archetype. Uh, there's a Bulma leader. Definitely one of the most hype things we'll be looking for are the foil beans. Foil senzu beans. There are foil senzu beans in this set. And if we can get a foil senzu bean, I will be hype after. Super duper hyper. I love beans. Such a good card. And I like the original art better than the alternate art, the new alternate art. I do have, you know, a number of the alternate art cards for decks to make sure my beans are shiny. But I am really excited for the Parallel Foil be reprint bean in this. Original bean art is the best. Um, if anybody in here is in any of the Dragon Ball groups or any of the chats, you know, if you guys want to send out a little message, Joku is stripping the Battle of the Battle Evolution boosters now. I know a lot of people are interested to see what are in these packs, what the pull ratios are. I mean, I guess we're not going to get real pull ratios since these are blisters. Do you prioritize keeping rare DBZ cards? ungraded if they're useful in your build yes so i definitely keep every card my dbz my dbs collection is um very organized and i make sure i have if i only have something one copy of a card um then that one copy will be safe to play i will not grade anything if i only have one copy of it there's one secret rare that i only have one copy of so i keep that one to play it is the um the Broly SR. Oh, hello, Mom. Welcome. Welcome to the Shrippum. Oh, here's another Vicious Rejuvenations pack. And all right, now I think we got all these out of their blister boxes. Double Dentist. We got Double Dentist in the chat. This is an exciting... My mom's birthday is on Tuesday, so that's really exciting. Got her some cool birthday presents. Mom, I think you'll be pretty excited about your birthday presents. All right, let's strip them. Brush attack, go! <laughs> Double floss attack. All right, the Dragon Ball packs, we don't need to do any rearranging because the hype card is always just right at the back of the pack. All right, Katopesla, we got the, uh, re these are both reprints. This is another reprint. This is a new card from the set. Goku Solar Flare, Cyberman Infinite Assault. Yo, know, blue yellow is getting some support in this set, so that's that's pretty exciting. I'm definitely interested in getting blue yellow stuff back in here. Looks like there's something shiny at the back of this pack. Oh, yo, Bardock, father and son reprint. This card looks so good. Yo, look at that foiling. That looks amazing. These cards are gorgeous. What? Holy hexagon. They're like, whoa. Yo, this, yo, Greg, what's good, dude? I got some battle evolutions at, uh, at, a uh, Target. Yo, this card looks amazing. This set looks so good. I'm so excited. I know they don't have SPRs in this set, and I'm definitely a little bummed about that, but can't be too bummed about it, because it just looks so good. Yeah, I don't know what's up with it, dude. Target's just, Target just had packs, I guess. Bergamo, the Unstoppable Colossus. That card is sick. Yeah, I mean, every pack we're going to get, you know, either a parallel foil, a reprint, or an SR, I guess. There's a lot of really cool SRs in this set. Um, this is a new Unison. Universe 4 Assemble. That's a reprint. There's a bunch of reprints. And, oh, this is the new Napa Leader. That's exciting. Homicidal Clones. 
Most dope. Glad the energy I sent helped. Yeah, thanks, dude. <laughs> it was very helpful. I appreciate it. I, ne I needed it. Oh, this card's awesome for U7 support. Cap is awakening. Got a reprint. Oh, yo, we got the SR Android 17 and 18. Siblings revived. Yo, that is a sick looking card. Oh, man. Yeah, I wish that they could also. It's kind of a bummer. I feel like I feel like it kind of like does a disservice to you guys running local gaming stores that like you're now at a disadvantage because this product's out there and people are going to have it before. And, you know, I don't know. Bandai Bandai's distribution. The story of, right? All right, we got to get that yokai energy. Yokai. 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 Can we get a Kai? Can we get a Kai? Can we get a Yokai? Yokai. 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 What's what's here? What's at the back of this pack? Yeah, let's just get right into it. Looks like a parallel foil. Oh, we got a parallel foil sin support. Great. Wonderful. Oh, we got to bless him a pack. Let's bless him a pack here. All right. The heroines. Here they are. Heroines be blessed. This packet shall learn your lesson, and we will pull the secret rare heroines card out of this pack. Most certainly. Take the blessings, please. There's our blessing pack. This is so exciting to have these cards this early. I mean, they were supposed to come out now, but there was whatever delays happened, and they couldn't get them out this time, so we were able to get our hands on a couple. You can find these at some targets, randomly. Um... Wow, a new Unison. This is an interesting card. This is the new uh, super combo for the heroines. Ooh, Nimbus got a reprint. I didn't realize Nimbus got a reprint. Oh, those foil Nimbuses are probably going to look great. Ooh, Broly, the Swift Berserker. Look at that parallel foil. Looks so good. Yo, very, very cool. This is a new card in the set as well. Put that over there. And a U9 Assemble. We'll leave that hang to hang out there at the back. Yeah, this is exciting. Battle Evolutions. Very excited for it to come out. If you guys in the, are in the Tri-State area, definitely go to Greg's Games to get your Battle Evolution and other trading card needs. Magic, Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! They got it all. Most best, awesomest trading card store. I highly recommend it. I love it. Greg's Games, the best. Big shout out to Greg. Thanks for coming by the stream, dude. That's a reprint there. That's a reprint. Bonds of Friendship, Android 8. Oh, look, we got a bean, not a foil bean, but can't be mad about a bean. Everybody loves a bean. Android 14, the mission begins. And oh, Basil, Fatal Rampage. That is a reprint, but that looks rad. I love how they did these reprints. These are really nice. I'm not a huge fan of the art on the card, but just the way they did the foiling just looks like... It's a really, really good looking card. Much love to you, Greg. You are the man, dude. Dude, man. Second SR there. All right, let's get this. Let's get this secret rare. Let's get this secret rare energy out there. Secret rare SER. We are going to find it. We are going to pull it. We are going to strip them. We're going to strip them the SER for sure. I wonder why they reprinted this card. I think it's Goku's Lineage, but I don't know how much that card actually does in Goku's Lineage. That's the new Yamcha Unison. That is a new card. That's a new card. This is a new card. Got a bunch of new cards. That is a reprint. The Oregano reprint. Bunch of reprints. A lot of this set is reprints. Oh, a Negate. Unexpected Casualties. Oh, Son Goku, the Path to Power. This is a cool card. This is a really cool card, and I really like how the foiling, like, I, I love when they do foiling, how when they do that, like, little outline outside the character that's, like, that iridescent hollow foil. Looks so good. Such good-looking art. Such a good-looking card. Let's get that in a sleeve. All right, what is next here? For our next Shrippum... It is a Battle Evolution strip em. Oh, I'm opening these like Pokemon packs. That's totally wrong. That's how you strip them. That's how you strip them, Dragon Ball packs. Come on, dude. Don't you know anything about how to strip them? This is like Bush League strip em techniques here. You gotta know it. 
Reprints, chilled army reinforcements. Oh man, look at that Cybermen. Remember that when Vegeta is just like, yo, <laughs> you Cybermen are trash. You're absolute trash. Look at you, you're making fools of yourself. Nappa, you're making a fool of yourself. I'm gonna blow up your little Cybermen and I'm gonna rock this Earthling. But Goku doesn't go down so easy. The man puts up a fight for his friends and the people that he cares about. Ooh, Vegeta, unyielding pride. That's a cool looking parallel foil. Very nice. Very nicely. Oh, shrip him. Oh, battle evolutions, shrip him. Another Catopesla, Sonic Justice. I'm excited to pull some of these parallel foils. Those parallel foils are gonna look great. Broly, the, the, the tamed beast, testing opposition. Look at all these Cybermen taking naps. We just some Cybermen just laying down, sitting sideways, boys in the days, on the taking a nap town. Ooh, San Caba, a reprint. Trio's the Danger, that's a reprint. That deck's pretty rad. My buddy Joe was playing that deck at Locals and he was putting in some work. Ooh, a Freeze's Call, parallel foil, nice. It's a good card. I like how on the parallel foils, they turn them into full arts. I think that's a really cool feature. All right, got a couple more battle evolutions here. Let's start out real hot and then it kind of slowed down a little bit. But let's see what else we got here. Let's get that secret rare, am I right, gang? Let's get that secret rare found. Ooh, the new TN leader. That's a cool looking card. Android 16 got support. I'm psyched that Android 16 got support. Aiderade. Ooh, parallel foil Nimbus. Yeah, yo, that looks great. Man, that looks so good. Let's get a closer look at that there. Just glasses on. Getting a close look on this Nimbus here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Wow. That is a nice looking Nimbi. Heck yeah. This is exciting stuff. Yeah, very crispy foil, dude. Whew, the parallel foil, the way that they cut the parallel foil and did the, the printing uh, differentiation is just really nice. And there's that Android 16 support. Gotta love our boy, Android 16. What an awesome character. All right. Here's some more reprinting. Ooh, it looks like there's something good at the back of this pack. Yo, is that the secret rare? Do I see the secret rare back there? If everybody thinks that it's the secret rare, smash that like button. I have a feeling that the secret rare is at the back of this pack. Time to graduate to perpendicular foils for Jonic. Yes. I think we're about to see a secret rare. I see something shiny in a specific way and I feel like I'm feeling the vibe. I'm feeling the secret rare vibe. Let's get that secret rare. The heroines come together. I'm just gonna put on my glasses preemptively here, just in case it is. And we got another reprint here, another reprint. Let's get that secret rare, it's the Maidens. And it is, yo ho, yo sha, yo -ho! Yes, it is the secret rare from this set heroine's lineage yo it first sideways secret rare look at that look at that card that is such a cool card this card is insane this card is just bunkers i anybody that thinks this this isn't a good card you're off your rocker to be able to steal a seven energy card and you can splash it in any deck secret rares that are free are awesome it's just free secret rares are fantastic yo let's go let's go Yo! I heard that the secret rares are one in three boxes, so the drop rates aren't like insane, but yo, we just pulled it. We just pulled it! Ah! Mom, I'm gonna get you one of these cards for your birthday. You just watch. It might be a little late since the set's coming out late, but I will get you one of these cards. You deserve it. 
My mom is a real live heroine. She is, she is a superwoman. Much respect to her. I would be nothing, with, I would be an idea without her. Shout out to my mom. This heroine's lineage goes to my mom, goes out to my mom. Much respect. Thanks for coming and supporting me through this chat. Wow, yo, so good. Oh my god. Oh my god. God. Oh, wow, yo, sha. Yo, sha. Rocky. Rocky boy. Rocky boy, poor hot fire cardo. Cardo. Hot fire cardo. Wow, this cardo is really hot, man. This card is a real hot card you pull here. Whoa! How you get such a shiny card, dude? Dude, how you get such a shiny secret card, man? Wow! Yo! Yasha! All right, gang. We got it. Big ups. What the heck? What the heck? Holy, holy hexagon. We got it. We pulled the secret. And I, I feel like I just knew it. I saw it back there. I saw, I feel like, I feel like this card's sideways. There's a sideways card back there and it's way too shiny. It's gotta be a secret rare. Come on. Come on. Yo. Sha. Very awesome. Into the secret rare binder. It will go. All right. On with the shrippums. Yeah, gotta get it in that sleeve ASAP. Good thing I'm wearing the glove. The maiden's charge into secret rare. What a win. What an absolute win. Maiden's charge into secret rare. True combo. True combo right there. Oh, man. These cards look great. Oh, that's a reprint there. Thanks, Doc. Thank you, Doc. Yo. Parallel for Tianshin Han. Unwavering Anchor. Very cool, very cool, very nice, very cool. Death Blaster. This is basically like a, if I understand correctly, that's just like another, uh... so you know it's good. So you know it's real quality Shrifum. I think that's a new Bloodlust. You can now have five Bloodlusts in your deck if you're running Freeze's Army, basically. But yo, that that uh, Altar Badrock, the Altar Badrock was sick. I was very hyped about that card. Oh, remote series bomb parallel foils are going to look rad. I'm just psyched that they're reprinting stuff in the new parallel foil style because the new parallel foils look so supremely better than the old parallel foils. It's like not even a competition. They just, they look so crispy and clean and awesome. Ooh, Aiderade parallel foil. Very nice. Very nice. Good looking card there. Okay, maybe we're gonna get a yokai from here. Yokai, yo, yokai, yo, yokai, yo, yokai, yo, kai, yo, 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 kai, yo, kai, yo, kai, yo, kai, yo, kai, no kai, no kai. That's okay. We got a secret rare. We got a secret rare from the new set. What the heck? How cool is that? All right, we got three more battle evolutions. Let's shrip them. Let's get these shrip them. Ronin 718, what's up, dude? SS Bad Rock, never ending vengeance. I am so psyched for all this blue yellow support. Yeah, we got 16 people in the chat here hanging out. What is up, gamers? Welcome to the Joe Crew. If you haven't subscribed already, please take the time to hit that subscription button. It really helps me out, you know, keep the ball keep the ball rolling with the show. Android 13 getting support. Golden Frieza getting in there. Adoptive Father Sung Gohan. What a king. Reprint, reprint city over here. Half this pack is reprints here. Ooh, Parallel Foil Tian Shin Han. Very nice, very nice. Shiny leader and oh yo booty oh 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 booty minna ora ni genki o wakate kure yo the the all art of booty his this man's hairdo is slicked back and I play this card so this is going right into a deck 
Heck yeah, it is. Alt Art Obuni, the new art, the new parallel foil. The man is rocking a ponytail like a absolute king. Yo, Booney, yo, Booney. The cards do look good, right? Hat, hat, my hat is off to Bandai. Bandai, if you're watching, I love what you do with this game. I love what you do with this printing. It is such a happy place for me to be. It's just so happy on my art eyes. These, these packs, they're just fun to open. They're just so much fun to open. Evolution Booster, I am so psyched for Evolution Booster to come out to drop so we can get all the cards, get play sets of everything, be rocking all the new support, playing with all the new cards, having a great time, overwhelming, activating main, you know, all the, all the fun stuff. Ooh, another bean. Hey, you can't be mad about a bean. You can never be mad about getting a bean. If you've learned anything from Dragon Ball, it's always a blessing to have a bean. Yo, the Universe 9 Supreme Kai Row parallel foil. Oh, Ronan, thanks for watching the uh, Wake and Power video. I, you know, I, I thought that it was a kind of good joke, you know? It's like, oh, thanks, dude. You know, the Goku, like, fell asleep in a fight. Like, when does Goku fall asleep in a fight? And it seems like he falls asleep and then awakens this new thing. I mean, it is called Awake and Power, right? So I feel like it kind of makes sense. And it got a rare Android 14 and 15 target acquired. Okay, here is our Bless in the Pack. This is the last Evolution Booster Pack. This is... Thank you. Thank you for uh, for watching. The last Evolution Booster Pack. I mean, we got the Secret Rare. So it's like... At this point, like, anything that we pull is hype. There's, like... There's, there's nothing at this point that isn't hype. Uh, you know, there's a lot of cool reprints. We got the Obuni reprint. We got the Bad Rock reprint. All such good cards. And I love that they're reprinting stuff that was Shatterfoil because I'm really not a big fan of Shatterfoil. So when they, you know, they're coming out with these beautiful looking foils and now that they, I feel like they really have it figured out. Pulled one Secret Rare. I need the other two. What, um, what set are you talking about, Ronan? Because uh, there are a few. Oh, thanks, Mom. Look good, but not as good as me. That's such a nice thing for you to say. I should be working out a little bit more. I've fallen off my game a little bit. I could I could be looking better. But thanks, Mom. Kato Pesla, Universe 3 Policeman. And yo, we got a Parallel Foil Super Combo for the Heroin Support. Very cool. And a rare King Vegeta Insubordinate. All right, yo, Dragon Ball packs have been shripped. This is what you learned in dental school. Vicious Rejuvenation. Oh, which uh, which which secret rare did you pull from Vicious Rejuvenation, Ronan? Please uh, let me know in the chat. You know, if you did get to pull that Kai, that is definitely the one to pull. And Paikwan, like, I think Paikwan is, you know, one of the cooler looking SCRs in the set, but it's such low utility. Like, there's really not much of anything you can do with him. And if you're playing blue, like, if you're playing blue and you're not playing Hatch, something's not lined up there. Okay, so this I'm very excited for. This is the uh, Shining Fates. Shout out to Greg's Games. Big shout out to Greg's Games. If any of you are in New Jersey, definitely go to Greg's Game to get your trading card products. But I was able to get my hands on this shiny VMAX Big shiny VMAX Dragapult box. I love Dragapults. This is very exciting for me. Um, I think I have an oversized loader. So I'm going to go get my oversized loader right quick because I want to put this card straight into a loader. Yo, Dongwoo, thanks for hanging out, dude. I'm glad you got to see that secret pull. And we got through all the Korean cards. So thanks for your support, my guy. This is a card from Japan. Yes, gregsgames.com. Thank you, JC LaForce, for throwing that in the chat there. So I just want to make sure that this card, yeah, this card should fit in here. I think it is the right size. Now, if you guys know where to get oversized loaders, I'm definitely looking to get some more oversized loaders. I want to, uh, you know, the cards that I have that I want to keep in good condition, I definitely want to keep them in oversized loaders but I will um 
Yes, you can. Hey, Jason the Forest, thanks for the promotion, dude. Thanks for the thanks for putting the plug in there. All right, so I'm gonna keep these two big cards in here, and then I can put my uh, I'll be able to put my Dragapult in between the two of these, I think. So I'll sandwich them in here. BCW. Is that the boo? I'm not sure what the BCW refers to. Um, oh, is that where to get oversized loaders? Because I definitely need to get some oversized loaders. If you guys could like throw in the comments, if anybody knows where to get oversized loaders and you could throw it in the comments, that would be awesome. All right, I'm gonna flip this camera around so you guys can see this Shrippum over here. This is a really great looking box. It's blue and yellow, very exciting. Blue and yellow are my favorite colors. If I haven't made that clear yet, I'll take this up as an op opportunity. Top loader, yeah, I need the really big, like the oversized ones. If anybody has a link to oversized top loaders, please. Oh, you pulled the Majin, dude, the, I think the Majin Buu honestly is the best secret rare from the set. Kai is really good and a lot of people are playing it, but the, like, I don't know, I think Boo is better. I think green having a counter counter that you can play for three energy is like really, really, really strong in certain decks. It's like, it's crazy. There we go. Look at this. Yo, this big shiny Dragapult. Dragapult. Dragapult is my favorite new character. Yes, I, I do open some Pokemon. I don't know as much about it, so I only like to open Pokemon on live streams. So people can tell me about, you know, what the different Pokemon names are if I don't know them because I open some in, in Japanese and stuff. Okay, so I got to get all these out of here like super carefully because I know whenever they put the cards in these things, they like really don't. Oh man, look at that shiny Dragapult. Wow, look at that big shiny Dragapult. That's so rad. Yosha. That is definitely, I, I want to get it graded actually. I know you can get big cards graded. I feel like it would be really fun to get that graded. Okay, uh, let's see here. How do we get, if anybody knows, do you know how to get these cards out without like just ruining them? I feel like there's no, they're like tucked in here. I need a surgical extraction kit. Oh, that, was, that wasn't that bad. Okay, so we got the Dragapult out. Yeah, doesn't it? Doesn't the Dragapult look so good? What's up, Eli? Welcome to the chat, dude. All right, we got that shiny V Dragapult. Now we got one in uh, Korean and English, so that's exciting. And then we got upside down, let it call in hand. Okay, we got that card. And then let's get this shiny VMAX Dragapult out of here. Very delicately removing. Aha, yes. Target acquired. And we got the cool Dragapult coin also. Counters. Flipping counters. Okay, let's get this in a sleeve as well here. I think this card is so cool looking. I think the, the shiny VMAX from this set, they look so rad. Super duper exciting. Okay, how do we get this giant card protected now? That's the real question. Okay, we're gonna get it out of here. We have the glove on, so that's okay to handle the card with the glove. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and sandwich it between these two cards. So one and two. Any stuff to scratch it on there. Okay, now it's sandwiched between these two cards. And then we'll put these in the top loader. And then if anybody knows where to get big top loaders, I definitely want to get myself some oversized top loaders or side loaders or whatever. Some kind of large loader so I can send this in because I would like to get it graded. This is a really cool card. Okay, let's get this camera turned back around now. And let's get a bless in the pack, shall we? We got a couple packs here. I don't know exactly how many packs are in here. I guess it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven packs. Seven packs on the bless in the pack. And we will do a one, two, three, four, five, six 
pack for the Blessed Pack. Actually, we only have one Dragapult, so let's bless in this Dragapult pack. Oh, Dragapult, thou art be blessed. Please take the lesson of the blessing onto you, as it will be true, and find us the Charizard within the packs. We haven't pulled a shiny V Charizard. So pulling a shiny V Charizard can be cool because we don't have one of those in our collection. But here we go. Let's get into the Shrippum. Bless him. Here we go. Shrippum. And I want to make sure I'm doing these right, doing the counting thing right here. So I know I got to get rid of this card back here. And then it's... One, two, three, four. You're guessing that I'm going to get the Skyla. All right. Nice guess. We'll see. I don't know. I'm kind of feeling Dragon. I'm feeling uh, Charizard energy. What do you guys think? You guys feeling some Charizard energy? Let's put out a little prayer for Charizard. Let's uh, let's get that vibe out there. Mina, ora ni genki o wakate kure Charizard o Charizard o Tropius Floatzel Rotom. Or see you later. Coughing. Excuse you. Shiny Zard. Looking for the Shiny Zard. Gym Trainers and Manaphy. All right. Next pack to shrip them. Praying. Praying for Zard. Praise for Zard. Looks in box. Praise in Zard. Looks in box. Looks for card. Looks for Zard. All right. One, two, three, four energy fire spin time let's get that fire spin going guys i'm gonna leave this gym trainer back here just so in case it is something good it's not gonna get damaged by this card holder here another gym trainer oh eldegoss where is that zard at zardo hey yo zardo Ooh, shiny the dean the dane i don't know if i'm saying that right mad party yo welcome to the mad party this attack does 20 damage for each pokemon on your discard pile that has mad party attack so you, what, you just pile your deck up with mad partiers let's get these mad partiers all together shiny mad party yo great looking card very nice and indeedy Indeedy foil, and that is indeedly a foil, and that's our gym trainer from before. All right, we got the Toxtricity pack here. That is how it works. Cool. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Nice, easy shrip them here. All right, so we got one, two, three, four there, and our energy is a leaf. Leaf, Erickson, Leaf, Energy. Floatzel, Ratome, Rusted Shield. I feel like with this box, we can't lose because we already got the huge, shiny VMAX Dragapult. That's like the ultimate win right there. Mad Party Pin Box. Oh, interesting. Shiny Dragon Ball for my shiny boy, Cutie Fan, and Professor Research. All right, a couple more packs here. What's maybe something shiny in here? Only a few ways to find out what is in the shiny, the strip on the pack. Hey, thanks everybody for hanging out. Thanks for smashing that like button. There's our energy right there. And maybe there's something exciting in this pack. We only have a few ways to find out by, sh by shripping the cards. Prayers for the Zard. Yo, hands up for the Zard. Where you at, Charizard? Where you at, my dragon? Dragon, dragon, rock the... Oh, yo, four gym trainers. Sick. Very cool. Look at these gym trainers. Draw two cards. If any of your Pokemon were knocked out during your opponent's turn, draw two more cards. Plus four. That's a plus four card. Radical. Full art gym trainers. Hype, hype, hype. All right. Maybe that means we won't get a, uh, a shiny, big, big shiny anything. But only way to know is to shrip them. Yes, lucky prayers for the Zard. When you're fighting to save America's family, oh, perhaps, please turn off your advertisement. Thank you. For all our 
Please turn off this advertisement. Thank you very much. And advertisement over. Thank you very much. All right. Zard Energy. Tuning into the Charizard Energy. More Pico. Yanma. Decidueye. Oh, I don't think we did the move four thing. Whoops. And Indeedy. There's our energy. So those are all going to be our regular. All right. Two more packs here. This is a Charizard pack. So let's strip them and see what we can get here. Charizardo. All right. One, two, three, four. Leaf Energy, Team Yell Towel, Gym Trainer, Luxio, Coughing, Morpico, Yan Ma, Horse C, Shinx, ooh, Reverse Oil Luxray, that's cool, and a Manaphy. Okay, here is our Bless in the Pack. This is our Dragapult Pack. So the Blessing shall be true, and the Blessing are cast unto you on this Shining Fates conundrum. Thank you for your blessings, and here is the lessons of the trip. What will we find in this final bless in the pack? All right, one, two, three, four. There's our energy, and it is ready to fight energy. And Ball Guy, Tropius, Floatzel, Shinx. Trapinch, Yanma. I'm feeling good about this pack. I don't know why, but I just feel like the vibe feels good for this pack. You guys feel that way? I feel like there's some, gonna be something like rad. Oh, yo, we got a shiny Phalanx. Nice, I know nothing. And we got a Ditto V, wow, cool. Okay, so we did get a shiny full art card. Very rad, not the Zard, but you can't be mad about a shiny full art. In the Bless in the Pack too, at that. Very rad, all right. Yeah, Battle Styles looks like it's gonna be cool. Sounds like they're uh, changing some stuff up. So I have one more box I can strip them if you guys wanna see, uh, we can go through it. It's a, uh, it is a, uh, it's this box with Lugia on it. If you got shiny War Kirby, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is a shiny War Kirby. Heck yeah. Uh, if you guys want to see, I, I can I can strip through this box. If you guys are, you know, feeling like it's been enough shrippums and you want to tune out for the evening, I totally respect that. Um, but I, I probably will be end, end, wrapping up after this box if you do uh, open this box. But you guys just let me know if you're here for it. Um, otherwise, we can, you know, I'll skip this ad. Pre-release battle styles dropped today. Some of the stores have started selling them. Already. So keep your eyes peeled. Cool. Good to know. I'm staying. All right, dude. For you, Eli, I will strip this box. If you're staying, dude, I'll rip them. I will strip them, no problem. And then we'll wrap up after that. So here's our last box here. And let's... Uh, Get into some shrippums. I guess these are gonna be the five card packs like the other uh, the other stuff. Send the energy. That's what I'm saying, Greg. Yo, Greg, thanks for hanging out, dude. If you guys um, are looking for a you know local gaming store to get your cards, I highly, highly, highly uh, recommend going to Greg's games. They don't have Japanese trading cards, but they do have tons of trading cards. They have all sorts of games, really wonderful games. I. Uh, about all, all my mom's birthday presents are this year are from Greg's Games. So, mom, uh, if, that, if that spoils what your presents are going to be, they are going to be things that you like. My mom loves games, and Greg's got a lot of games. So, here are our packs. Greg's is awesome. Drive me that, and now I'm a supporter. That's the way to be. Way to be, Dan. Thanks for hanging out, dude. Thanks for hanging out in the chat. Okay, let's get a bless in the pack, shall we? Lugia, bless him. There's like a secret rare Lugia in this that looks really cool. I would love to pull that card. 
So here's our bless in the pack. Moms love cards. Heck yeah. Bless in the pack, Lugia, you're blessing. Lugia is definitely like one of my top six favorite Pokemon for sure. I am absolutely sure of that. Bless them and blessed. These are Japanese booster packs. Um, I believe the I believe the uh, the set is called um, something Impact, Bursting Impact, or something like that. I think is what it's called. Could be wrong about that. Please correct me if I am wrong. And ooh. Nilego, I think that Pokemon is called. The rapid one, not the single strike. Yeah, I mean, the, I don't know much about Ushu Rifu. I, I, it's like, isn't that, I, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but I think that was added in the DLC to um, Sword and Shield, which I didn't play the DLC. I want to. After opening these cards, I'm definitely like more excited about playing the DLC. Are you gonna get the EV Heroes? I don't know. Evolution? Wait, yeah, I don't know what EV Heroes is. Explosive Impact. Yeah, I think that's what this is called. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Explosive Impact. That sounds right. Yes, Greg. Thank you for the info. Thank you for the info. Urshifu. 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 Thank you, Eli. Yeah, Urshifu looks cool. I want to learn more about it. Oh, we got a GX Shuckle, I think. Isn't that Pokemon named Shuckle? Cool. Nice looking. Let's put that in a sleeve. Sleeve up the shuffle. Comes with all the evolutions. Comes out in May. Hmm, cool. Uh, Eevee Heroes is the new Japanese set. Cool, yeah. I mean, I would. Have, I love I love Eevee. Night, Mom. Thanks for coming by. Play the trip, All right, what do we got here? Let's get that full art Lugia. Let's put that Lugia energy out there. I would love to pull Lugia. I love Lugia. Such a cool Pokemon. Definitely one of my favorite Pokemon of all time. Lugia. Such a rad monster. I think each of these boxes has like one of those rainbow secret rare kind of deals. I think you get one. We got the, we got the, um, we got the Psyduck. Yeah, Lugia, present yourself. Lugia, we are here and we are interested in you, you know, coming to say hi. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Tell us a little bit about what's going on with you and how you're... Oh, Entei. Cool. You know, how's business been? Have you been busy? Has it been casual? How is it in, you know, your underwater wonderland? I think Lugia can swim like underwater, can it? Premium Bandai. Well, this ad is clearly targeted at me for exactly what I like. All right. Yeah, thanks, everybody, for hanging out. Thanks for smashing that like button. Y'all are the best. I've had a very, very fun night streaming here. I hope you guys have had fun as well. Yeah, I can fly and swim. Cool. Yeah, Lugia is so rad. There's a Shining Lugia card that I picked up from Greg's. It's like one of the nicest-looking shiny cards ever. Um, I think it was a promo. Uh, I think maybe the set was called Shining Legends or something, because I think that there's other Shining Pokemon cards in that set that also look really good. What do we have here? Ooh. Yo, what is this Pokemon's name? This is uh, second generation Grass Starter, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. I was trying to remember this one's name, and I can't remember it because I'm a scrub. Um, if somebody could just throw that in the chat, I would greatly appreciate Meganium, Meganium, Meganium. Yes, that's right. The other two are Cyndaquil and, or no, Cyndaquil's the baby. Uh, what is it? Uh, Feraligator is the other one, right? I don't remember. I need, I need to learn all the, I need to learn all the, uh, starter Pokemon. I need to step my game up. I'm going to do it. Gen 2, best gen. I love Gen 2. I think Gen 2 is awesome. Typhlosion. Typhlosion is the third evolution of that one. Yeah, Typhlosion and for, Typhlosion, Feraligator, and Meganium. And then what are their, what are their um, base names? Quilava. Quilava. Is Quilava the second? That's Cyndaquil, right? That's Cyndaquil, and then it turns into Quilava? Cyndaquil, Quilava, Typhlosion. Word. 
Word up. Thank you for the info. Thank you for the insider info. Gen 3 and Gen 4. Word. Yeah, I mean, I feel like, you know, each gen, I, I was, you know, I was like in and out of Pokemon. I was really into it when it first came out and then kind of got more into Dragon Ball. But um, through being in and out of it, I've appreciated different Pokemon. And I feel like each generation, I probably have a favorite Pokemon from each generation. I should I should figure that out, who, who each of my favorite Pokemon is from each generation. Dragapult is definitely my favorite most recent. What, what gen are we in now? Is it like... 11 or something like that. Cyndaquil, Chikorita, and Totodile. That's right. Totodile. Totodile's one turns into for alligator, and Chikorita turns into Meganium. Cyndaquil. Cyndaquil. Yeah. Gen 8. We're in Gen 8 right now. Okay. That sounds believable. So I only have. Uh, what? 8. Kario is my favorite Pokemon. Cool. So when is the next generation of Pokemon coming out? Ooh. Ooh. Full art Swissine. That is very cool. Very, very dope. Are right, that 3D is rad. What a rad card. Excellent pull. Milk tank. Got a tank of milk there. we got here Ooh, umbreon cute early next year it is a past japan gen 4 game well they're rebooting they're rebooting diamond and pearl and then they're making legends Arceus. so that's all coming out next year I'm ho i hope that they make a pokemon edition switch if they make a pokemon edition switch because i definitely want to get one of the new switches but if they make a pokemon edition one i will be hype 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 Ooh, blissey very nice very nice blissey looking great taking care of taking care of everybody's hp making sure everybody's got all the hp they need for their difficult day ahead of them so considerate such such pure thoughtfulness that's cute pokemon are just cute there's no real you can't really argue with that you just feel word no date yet no i know game freak is working on a gen 9 game which is why the upcoming games are only co-created by game freak oh interesting that makes sense cool so the gen 9 game i mean Gen 9 game is it's gonna be for Switch, right? Like moving forward, they're only making Pokemon games for Switch, if I understand that correctly. I've seen how cancer can affect the people I care about. That's okay, we'll skip this myself. ad here. Ooh, that's a cool looking card. Yo, thanks to all 11 of you hanging out here in the chat. Thanks for all the information. I feel like I've learned... So, I feel like I learned so much about Pokemon when I open Pokemon cards. So it's really fun opening Pokemon cards because they're great looking cards. Switch and Wii. Really? They still make games for Wii? I didn't realize they were still producing Wii games. Yo, Ty Typhlosion, right? I think that's Typhlosion. Cyndaquil turns into Typhlosion. And the middle evolution is Greg's boy, but I can't remember his name now. I'll get it though. Believe in me. It's just gonna take me some time. I think Perunga brought us that secret rare. That was crazy. You guys remember that? Remember when we pulled that secret rare from Evolution Booster? That was wild. Wild style. Ooh, that's cool. Alright, a couple more packs here. Thanks for everybody for hanging out. Thanks for the Wii because hostile is the Wii. The one kids. Oh, interesting. I had no idea. That's very interesting. Quilava. Quilava. Thank you, Greg. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah. Thanks again to everybody for hanging out. Thanks for hitting that like button. Oh, Raikou, I think is that one's name. I like Raikou. Raikou is a cool Pokemon. 
So again, there, there should be some, uh, you know, one of those shiny full arts in here, I think. One of those rainbow, shiny rainbow full arts. I think the live streams are your good luck charms. Yeah, I mean, I think so. You know, we're getting, we're blessing packs. We're just pulling hot cash. That Charizard was just crazy. I'll never forget pulling that Charizard. What a moment in my life. What an absolutely epic gamer moment. Such, such supreme hot cash. Just supremely, supremely, totally, completely hot cash. Quilava. That's Quilava. That's Greg's boy. I know it now. I know now that Pokemon is named Quilava. It evolves from Cyndaquil and it turns into Typhlosion. And that Pokemon is... Hey, thanks for your luck, boys. Eli, thanks for your luck, dude. Just pulled Greg's boy. Oh, yo! GX Lugia, that is sick! Oh, man. Oh, cool. Okay. All right, so... In the last in the last box, uh, I pulled this shiny VMAX Japanese Charizard. It was wild. There's a video you can watch. I made a highlight video. You can, you can check it out. Um, okay, so I think there's a chance that we might pull the rainbow uh, Lugia because in the last, um, yeah, I have a feeling because the last box we pulled the uh, the Psyduck. Like we pulled the same GX as that secret art. So I think there's a chance and it's going to be in one of these. Yeah, that art was rad. That is definitely getting a special place in the book. So good looking. Lugia. All right, couple more packs here. Oh, I wonder if it's in the Bless in the pack. Maybe it is. Maybe we got a secret. I mean, I don't know if a secret comes in every box. I'm just assuming that there's one secret in every box because that's kind of what I've experienced so far, but I don't know exactly what the pull rates are. If you guys know, feel free to let me know in the chat. I, I am curious about it. And, ooh, that's cute. Some kind of milk. Some type of milk. We're getting close. We're getting closer to the bust the pack. Every time we don't open something hot cash, that's one step closer to a hot cash that could or might be in the bust of the pack. So exciting stuff. Definitely. Chikorita. Alright, alright, alright. Hard hat. Gotta protect your hat head. Gotta make sure you're wearing your helmet at the appropriate time, timing. And what do we have here? And what is in the pack? Hey, Greg, do you know how the boys did at the uh, at the event today? And, ooh. I don't know. I haven't, I haven't checked any of the chats or talked to them, so I'm not sure how they're doing. But I know, I know Miguel's first game was tough, but he got it. But I imagine they're doing pretty well. You know? They're all good boys. They're all good boy players. All right, we're like... If it's not in this pack, we're three packs away from the boss in the pack. So it's pretty hype. What is... Oh, we got the, the shiny hard hat. <laughs> all right, so we got bodybuilding. We got the we got the GX, or we got the metal, the hero's metal, and we got the hard hat. What a, what a distribution of full art shiny cards. So that may be like our secret for this box. I don't know if it is or if it isn't. You guys can let me know. Uh, maybe we won't get one of the, that's the secret word. So our secret was a hard hat, not Lugia. Just head protection. Fair enough, fair enough. Can't argue with the hard hat. It's good to protect your dome, you know? You gotta keep that dome protect. Oh, that's cool. What is that? That is an interesting looking card. Interesting trainer card there. Very cool. That's a new gem Pokemon also, isn't it? That one there. All right, we got one more here and then it is our Bless in the Pack. And then we are Prism Star. Cool. So I guess it's not gonna be a 
shiny like that but let's see what we can get in here and it's just all this normal stuff but it is finally time for our blessing the pack so blessing the pack we hope you have something wonderful in here and in here we will find what the blessing has for our mind anything anything special let's see special special not special. Ooh, that's a nice looking card. Espeon. Nice looking Espeon. All right, guys. That has been the Shrippums for tonight. Thank everybody for coming and hanging out. I had a great time. I hope you guys had a great time. I had so much fun. Thanks to... Thanks to everyone for, you know, all your support. Thanks for keeping the chat under control. Those of you moderators that were there taking care of business, that was super easy for me. I felt like I didn't really have to engage with uh, much silliness at all. It was just really, really good. Hey, thanks for the hangs, Joe. Thank you for the hangs, Joe. Let's uh, let's get that secret rare out here so we can see it as we, as we tune out. What is that fire pull, that fire secret rare? Yo, it looks so good. Great looking card, great looking night. Thank you guys for coming by. Let's get a look at the SR. What's which SR you want to see? You got a couple of the hot hot cash. Yeah, that's this, that's the SCR. That's the S the SCR right there. I'm gonna move this light so you guys can see. Like, oh yeah, just looks great. Great looking card. Hey, thank you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful evening. This has been Joku DMD. If this is your first time here, please take the time to hit that subscription button. It really helps me out. And uh, if you guys are, you know, already part of the Joe crew, these Holy Hexagon sweaters are going to be coming soon. These Holy Hexagon... I didn't order from Europe. Actually, I went to uh, I went to Target and I found some at Target. But yeah, we pulled the secret and it's just, you know, it's pretty wild. Yeah, the Dragapult's awesome. I love Dragapult also. I think Dragapult's such a cool Pokemon. But uh, yeah, guys, it's been Joku DMD. Thanks for coming to watch my show. If you are a returning member of the Joe crew, thank you. These Holy Hexagon sweaters will be coming soon. Very excited about them. And everybody else, you know, if you would subscribe or share with your friends or whatever, it really helps me out. Uh, thank you, guys, and I will see you next time. Good evening.